we have a special earnings report. We're going to talk about Frontier Airlines, which just reported Q1, a smaller than expected loss, better than expected revenue. Let's bring in Barry Biffle, CEO of Frontier. Uh, Barry, when you look at the first quarter, there's a lot of concern about the consumer, especially on the lower end, pulling back. Are you seeing that at all? No, we have not seen that, Bill. And uh, thanks for having us, but we have not seen a change in, in the consumer behavior at all. It's very strong. So when you look at all of this and the fact that you're trying to attract more business customers, you've introduced biz fares. The question I always get about Frontier is how much of this is leisure? How much of this can be business? What are you noticing in terms of the take rate with biz fares? So historically, we've been about 4 to 5% business travel, which is primarily small business. Um, and we would like to get that to, you know, close to double that, high single digits, 10%. Um, but uh, we're seeing great take rate with the, uh, with the biz fare. Uh, it's exceeding expectations. And I think along with the other premium products that we've launched, like our Upfront Plus, this is like a European business class, as well as our premium economy seating, um, we're seeing pretty good take rate. I mean, there, there's uh, a lot of small businesses that are really excited about the new products. You're trying to basically uh, become more than just a low-cost carrier. Can you walk that bridge? Because a lot of people look at Frontier and they say it'll only be low-cost. It's going to be tough for them to move beyond that, whether it's to business, whether it's to more premium uh, offerings. Well, look, we, we are the leaders in lowest in low cost. In fact, we actually lowered our cost uh, stage adjusted in, in the first quarter. I think we're one of the only ones. The industry is up mid to high single digits uh, in cost. And but we think that. You know, we're not going to go after the big corporates, but we think the small business and those like meeting and conventions of some of the large corporations can benefit from our from our low fares. Uh, do you have any concerns about having an all Airbus fleet? Look, there's no, been no issues with Airbus, certainly nothing compared to what Boeing is going through. But you're tied in, whether it's the A320 uh, or any other Airbus aircraft. Um, and as we've seen with uh, companies tied into an all Boeing fleet, uh, that can come back and bite you. Do you have any of those concerns? Uh, no, we, we are really proud to be an all Airbus uh, airline. It's, it's been fantastic for us. We, we love our relationship uh, with Airbus, and uh, we feel very excited about it. They have had some of their own supply chain challenges, um, but uh, you know they just, they just built a great product, and we're excited to be partners with them.